My name is Barbara the Welder and I'm a full-time metal sculptor. Our project today is super easy, super cool, and there's such a variety to what you can do with this. You can do this one type of sculpture for the whole rest of your life and still never get two of the same pieces. So check this out. The material you're going to need for this project is one bucket of stuff. Once you have your bucket of stuff, figure out what word that you want to make. Today I have decided to make the word love. By laying out all our bucket of stuff onto the bench, it's easier to see the parts that we're going to use for our letters. And you can make letters in a couple of different ways. You can use random bits of stuff to make a letter like this or you can make a letter like that and the fun part about this is is there's no right way to do it and you can make the letter L in 20 different ways and it's just it's different every time As you see, the sculpture goes through an evolution. So what I thought I liked at first, it didn't go with what else I had out of the scrap pieces. And so I just, I changed it as I went. So your next step now is to go ahead and weld it up. Weld each letter individually and then weld each letter together. Now that you have your sculpture welded up, you can decide whether to have it hang on the wall or to have it as a piece that stands up on a, on a bench or a desk. So if it's gonna hang on the wall, sometimes if your letters are in the right position, you can actually balance it on like a nail or a picture hanger like right on the wall and you don't need to do anything else. Sometimes you might need to take a piece of chain and weld like a chain that um, like a piece of bike chain like I used for the V, um, just here to here, or a piece of just any like playground chain, not playground, but chain for like a swing, like a kid's swing set, um, tie a string to it. I mean, it's just, you can hang it in several ways, or you can have it, uh, and what I'm gonna do with mine is I'm gonna make it for uh, like on a desk or a, a bookshelf. I'm just gonna take and weld the piece onto here like this. There you go. Now you have a really great one of a kind piece of scrap metal art. You finish it with a wire brush, like clean up any kind of discoloration. Use a hammer and a chisel to clean any spatter up. You can leave the finish like this, or you can put a clear coat over it. It's your choice. But there's just absolutely no, like, no limit on what you can do with this. You can spell out family, you can spell out welcome. Um, you can put your family's last name. It's just. It's such a fun project because there's just such this huge variety of what you can do with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Check out social media, uh, Barbie the Welder, and check out my website, barbiethewelder.com, to check out more of my shenanigans and what I'm doing. And if you guys have any comments or questions, leave them in the comments. I do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. So thank you guys very much for watching the video. And happy welding!